I'm making this tape for them. 37. It's my volunteer job. High five. It's four. Is it? High five. Sorry, Stan. High five. Right here. Thirty-one. 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 Thirty-one.
side of the line as it towards the race track area. <laughs> number 17, number 17, Jay Allison, are you here? Number 33, Cindy McKenna. Cindy McKenna. Runners. <laughs> number 84. Number 84. Kenneth Webster. Hey guys, we're not getting organized today. Would y'all please move to, move to my left, get on the right side of the starting line here so we can get going? Should have made those last minute instructions five minutes ago. Come on. Henry's going to start the clock at four o'clock whether you're ready to go or not. Would you please get to the correct side of the starting line? It's a custom here at the Old Dominion that before we start the race, we have a moment of silence for friends and comrades that aren't with us any longer. So if everybody please be quiet for about 10 seconds, I'd appreciate it. In Isaiah, it was written that the Lord asked, Who will go for us and whom shall I send? And a voice answered, I will go send me. May all of you be blessed by God and have a good day today. Last minute numbers. Number 17, Jay Allison. Number 17, Jay Allison. Number 33, Cindy McKenna. Number 33, Cindy McKenna. <laughs> Number 84, Kenneth Webster. Number 84, Kenneth Webster. Go, Rob! No!
see you on the trail. You're going to take the shortcut again this year, are you? <laughs> I've got it on tape. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Yeah. Is this yeah. your first time doing this? Uh, I'll do it. Pick a local one to start. That's smart. Messy little campers, aren't they? <laughs> Doors are rattling around. Oh. You do have water? Yep, yeah. water until the next station. That's when you get the food. Hmm? Yeah. We go straight or right? Uh, right. Yeah. Uh, Good job, go you guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's scary, isn't it? <laughs> hey! That's King Jordan. Don't reuse the cups. Yeah. The reason why not. 
Yeah. What you got here, guys? We got water and we've got goldfish, we've got Snickers. That's right. Oh, come on, come on. Hey, Except for Snickers and goldfish. If there was no rules. You got a trash bag? There was uh, one. Just put it in. Oh, yeah. Thanks, buddy. What's that? Oh, this is uh, goldfish Snickers and stuff? Goldfish. Oh. But you can't have anything. We don't got any coke or anything. Oh, I gotta go around with a bunch of mouth here before I can get anything? Yeah. Okay. Beautiful day for a run, isn't it? Until. No complaints. No complaints. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Oh. What do we got? We got water. We got goldfish. We've got, goldfish. We've got yes. Got and all you can have is. Thanks. Excuse me, guys. Thank you. Until the launch day. Thank you. This water stream? Yes. You got. Oh. We've got coke and stuff at the next. At the next site. So. <coughs> Thanks, fellas. No problem. <laughs> Thank you. <coughs> Thank you, please. Check it. Water? Yeah, we got water. And you can get Coke or I don't know what they have at the next site, but they got some of them says water. Maybe scotch. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. No problem. Two more. Yes, we're getting this. Yeah. What do we got here? Water? Yep. Little bug juice. Here, turn. Get filmed. Okay, I'm just getting some video. Take care. You guys holding up all right? Oh, yeah. Good, good. You gotta be at this stage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already tired. Uh, well, yeah, you got the hard uh, Have a Snickers. <laughs> Take care. Three miles. Okay, I figured you had enough water in my pack. Number 10? Yeah. Okay. I'll take a drink. How many of you had come through so far? Oh, goodness. I hear them counted. Lots? Yep. Numbers, guys. 57. 57? 96. 96. You got it. Thank you. All right. Just water here, guys. Just water. Numbers? 69. Help yourself. Just water here. What would you think about the hill? 24. 24. 24. 73. 73. Wow. What's the top one? That's water. Water. All water. Yeah. <laughs> All set? Three miles to the next one. It's all downhill. How y'all feeling? Was the hill okay? Rough? It was just long. Not very steep. 
Leave it a munch on it. Just, just goldfish. Are you open? Not yet, but they're open. Could you open up some goldfish, please? Yeah, take the shore high. Good morning, people. Good morning. Right. What's the number? 13? 13. You got it, sir. Thank you. <laughs> We have water poured down to the next one. Three. We have water poured, they're all. Water, that's it. That's all we got. What's the number? 77 and 7. Got it, got Thank it. You folks. Good luck. Thank you. All right, thanks for being out here. Oh, you're welcome. Glad to be here. 60? Yes, sir. Who's Up behind over. you? 45. <laughs> Three miles to the next one, all downhill. Thanks, guys. All right, you're welcome. Thank you. 58? 58. Okay. Well, you guys look mighty good. Hey, how you doing, Pat? Aaron go bra. What's the number? Number 12. You got it. Thank you. 53. 53, you got it, sir. What's in there, water? Water, just all water. All right. Number sure. Go ahead. Number twenty. Twenty. Got you, sir. Thank you. Eighty-six. Eighty-six. No power aid. All water. That's not Forty-six. Forty-six. Yes, sir. Ninety-five. Ninety-five. Okay. Ninety-five. Ninety-five. Thanks, Al. Forty-one. Thanks, Al. Forty-one. Thanks, guys. You're welcome. Please got water. Yeah, just water. Is there an aid station at? Good morning. Good morning. 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 
morning. Feeling good today? So far. <laughs> yeah, we're we're on way too fast. I'm going way too fast right now. Oh, yeah. That's a fact. Number. 57. 57. Next year. 96. 44. 44. Yeah, I know. 73. 73. Yeah, we're good. Thanks. Some more water ready here for me? No, what I got. <laughs> oh. Here's some more water. Right there. I can catch you. How's that one doing? Cups. They use the cups for laying here. Go in everything, don't I? I tell you. I give them There's cups on top of the power aid. This is water, that's power aid, the middle one's water. Water, water, power aid. Power aid. Not a drop of drink. Anybody have any comments at this point? It's too early. That one's a white bed. I'm going to take a nap for another three hours. Enough water, Jen? We're back. Good, thank you. Appreciate it. I'm just, did you get some up top? You're going to here. When I see you drive down the road, I'm leaving. Okay. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Everybody's carrying that car gel stuff. That stuff is disgusting. I've had goody for it. No, power gel is nasty. What is it? Pure protein in uh -huh. gel form. Nasty. Nasty, nasty. That sure be using one of those. Oh, we put our That's water too. Look, look. What is that? Exactly. Wasting the water.
It's mixed, it's mixed normal. Okay. Five gallons, oh, five bags. Five How are you doing? Good. You? Great. How oh, is it so far? Oh, it's beautiful morning. It's going to be perfect. <laughs> How's, uh, How's the humidity? None. None. I'll tell you, those None. guys at the first aid station on top of Woodstock Gap, I was a little worried about them. They said they were almost out of water. So. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's, uh, I'm not too worried about that because I've got it all. Okay. Okay. You can come down the hill. Yeah. You can come down the hill. Okay. Need anything? Number 37. Need anything? Look at that. What are you selling? Water, Powerade. Powerade. That's my cut at all. Number. Not uh, 
There's three runners not too far down there. Here they come. These are the front runners, aren't they? No, you've already missed the front runner. He's I ten have? Ahead of you. Two get two. Oh, okay, thanks. Nice. Two. Yeah. Same, the one that got one last year is ten minutes. He's here ten minutes sooner this year. Uh, it, it was uh, 43 last year, and it's 33 this year. Oh, you mean finish? Yeah. Well, it's right here. <laughs> 17 hours, wasn't it? 17. Something like that. Close to 17. I get to turn these things over. <laughs> no? Did you lock it? No. No? I don't even know. <laughs> That's Mike right there. Is it Michael? Oh, great. Wrong. Where is he? Right there. Yeah, it is. He's got his Pentagon. He's right here. The, the next, no, the next guy. Give me that sight of that, because that's the one, all right? Good job. Of course, I'd be dead. Why is he yeah, walking? <laughs> I got your, you want your hip coffee? Do you want the first ones or the other ones? You want three of them? Yeah. All right. Good job. All right, you're right. I don't care if it's cloudy today, but I want some sun. Okay. Yeah. 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 You're, you're running out of time to do things. You just run out of time. You, you need about two more weeks to get ready, and but the you okay? you stop and have a break. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're so you're so used up that you don't even want to think about it for two more months. <laughs> car. Don't worry about the car. Like I had to be your cousin. Like sit down, Maria. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm usually never at my estimated time, and I'm dead on this time. I don't know if that's good or bad. Let's we'll see. Where are we going? Down? Jeez, I knew there was a lot No, this is good. Thanks. Do you want this protein the next time, right? Yeah. I'm going to take a dip next time. Just take a look. A lot? Hey, yeah. Thanks. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to change the shirt. Yeah, I'm going to change the shirt. He's like stuck with peanut butter jelly. He's like, 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 he's Beach. No, this is, this is that mountain right there. I mean, this is an artist look at it combined with facts. <laughs> Can I get a picture of it? No, no, yeah, yeah, Sherman's, it's all over here. It's so nasty. Look how steep it is on the way down. Well, it is to scale, it's damn near straight down. Yeah. I mean, hairpin turns, and if you're not used to driving, you're not used to driving mountain sheep. And a small car. Yeah. My wife used to do, we swapped vehicles, she'd drive my Toyota four-wheel drive over and I'd drive the big car. car up, car up, watch yourself. Okay, uh, Matt. Hey Matt, here's your guys. <laughs> my guys. Well, yeah, they're your guys. <laughs> I've never done interviews. I've talked to reporters, but never interviewed. I'm a reporter. <laughs> oh, that's right, but I want with a camera. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, you're Pat Bot's son? Son-in-law. Son-in-law. I've forgotten your name. Ray Waldron. Ray Waldron. And I've been involved with this race since about 87. And uh, what's that, almost 11 years now. And we're standing down here at what we call Four Points, 758 and Chrisman Hollow Road. And our first runners just come through at about 11 o'clock in the morning. It's a beautiful day for a run, 72 degrees, no sun. We're having, well, so far they're having a good time. Trails marked well. We haven't heard any complaints. So we're doing good. Well, I already know that, what's involved in the race. I've interviewed your mom. I get, do you, do you, well,
All the pit crews are here now, right? Correct. Could you just talk a little bit more about the race itself? From what point? From like what angle? Well, I guess, do you know how many volunteers helped out with this? And, and who's involved in the 82nd Airborne? <laughs> yeah, not enough. I uh, can say that. Who's helping out with the race today? Right now, we always count on volunteers to run our aid stations, and we have 23 aid stations. Some of our volunteers do two aid stations. So we need at least two people per aid station. That's 48 folks is what we need right off the bat. And we've got, we're about eight or so people short. So we've had to force folks to, to double up. So we can always use help. If anyone wants to volunteer to come help us out, we can find you an aid station, a long one, a short one, one in the middle of the day, one at the end of the day. I know that uh, the 82nd Airborne has helped out before the National Guard. Who is involved uh, today? I saw some. Uh, we have some uh, volunteers who are in the Guard who are out helping us today. And uh, they've been real good at uh, picking up anything I need, whether it's uh, parking or directing people where to park or, or pointing the runners in the right direction to go down this road and things like that. They always pick up whatever I need in the middle there. And how many of those are involved in this? Oh, uh, we got about 10 are involved right now. So you have a few uh, sheriff deputies. They always the, the sheriff deputies are there to to do their job, you know, to police the area and to make sure there's no trouble from uh, uh, anybody driving down the road. Uh, to uh, watch for traffic violations at all, uh, specifically anyone speeding up and down the, the the road where we where our runners are are on. So they're really doing their job. They're not so much helping us they're they're assisting in what they do they're just make their presence more known today is this the best weather we've you've ever had um i would say it is because it hasn't rained yet and i don't know if it's gonna rain uh if it starts to rain tonight because it's supposed to be in the low how's it going good Go straight to Elizabeth. Okay. Okay, thanks. All right. Let's see, there were 99 signed up. How many, I know one dropped out from the flu. How many ended up? Signing in this morning. Oh, my
<laughs> How's it been going? It's, I'm slow. I'm a back of the packer, but it's going just fine. If I finish it, it'll be my first hundred miler that I've finished. Although certainly not the first out of the <laughs> Good luck. Uh, how do we know? And how are you doing? I'm doing fine, except for the gnats. <laughs> I'm doing good. Where are you from? Uh, Lancaster, South Carolina is 30 miles south of Charlotte. North Thank you. I live on state line. Oh. Let me see if I can interview these guys over here. I'm going through my second childhood. No, no, no. You're going through your second childhood. I just bought a sports car. Tell me I got more. an earring. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been running? Oh, God. Uh, 25 years. Do you uh, participate in Leadville and some of the others? Uh, no, I, I haven't, but I am. I'm going out. I'm going to Leadville this year. I was out there two weeks ago. It's nice. Snow still out. 39 degrees. Are you busy? No, not really. I'm waiting on a ride home or back to the hotel. Oh, you're leaving? You're Watch. out? Watch. What happened? Not, I just, I pulled out. Oh, you, you're out? What happened? Did you? Uh, nothing really. I just didn't feel that well. So I'll do a 50 miler next week. And when do you come this way? And do that. This is great. This is great. Hey guys, now we gotta let the truck get out. We may drop Watch out, folks. The truck. Thank you. We're running. Hey, 
think you're trying to get us. Okay. Okay. No. He may go here. He said he's something. <laughs> okay, you guys. How are you enjoying this race today? Fine. Got any comments? Yeah. What? Uh, that they're doing good. good. <laughs> and are you all helping out? Yes. What have you been doing? Um, helping the runners, chant them on. <laughs> giving them food. <laughs> One on the left. Yeah. All right, <laughs> Number 72 might drop. Okay. Okay. 125 and a half. I thought so. I've been approaching it as a dynathon. You gained weight? Yeah. Oh. Kind of into preservation, so I've been eating on the trail. <laughs> <laughs> Work the lead bill. Yeah? Do you just keep eating a lot as you're going? Yeah, as much as I can. Thank you. Yeah, I eat as much as I can. On the this trail. spot right here. And, uh, no. How much weight have you gained? I've gained about uh, three pounds, two and a half pounds. And uh, I think I was a little dehydrated when I weighed in last night. Do you train a lot? Uh, quite a bit, mainly in the mountains. So more hiking up steep stuff. More going up up steep hills. So. Thank you. Gladly, thank you. Where are you from? Where are you from? From Albuquerque, New Mexico. Yeah. One problem was I went out too fast. These these easy roads and gradual downhills cost me to overpace. I want to make sure we catch. Thanks a lot. This is one. Yeah. One twenty-one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, trouble last time. Second place runner so far, right? Yeah. 143. All right. He's right on. He's right on. Ah. He's you don't have to wait. Oh, just get fueled. That's all right. It's not mandatory. Oh. So how do you feel? You're in second no, place. Can you get some oh. drink? Real good. Real good. You might get. I left Biohazard this place on one rock out there. Uh, get the red bag out. How's the trail, Well, Mark? Just sit out in the cab bag. No, no. So no. No. You need to paint more rocks at that. Oh, sure. Was it Duncan Hollow? Yeah. <laughs> yeah this one I'll tell him. Yeah, thanks a lot. Turkey sandwich? Yeah. You want at least half of the hole? How long has it been in the face bag? 3.2. 4. Station. Well, 3.2? 3.2. Handler Station? Nine. Nine, Nine miles would be the gap. Open it. No! Got it? Come on. Huh? No. I gotta get around. 
Yeah. Well, Lisa got the number two runner. 47. Actually, <laughs> at some point I've got to catch the number one runner. Number one runner. Probably by the time. It's by the time! This is the third place we're runner then. Oh, that's a little This is the chili pepper man. Elizabeth, what's his number? 64. I'm sorry. <laughs> I wasn't looking where I was going. Okay. What else? What else? Um, your drinks are up there. Okay. Here's some trash. All right. Here's some trash. Vaseline? <laughs> <laughs> She's not actually be shot for a deer, is what I was trying to do. It's anti camouflage. Either that or it's coordinated. There comes a little troublemaker. It's on right away. Okay, what do you do, Tony? I need five people. Oh, okay, let's see. Uh, 25 and 26 are family. Darling, they're the last two. They're the last two. Good. Keep the cute. Okay. What about 35? Uh, 35. Can I say hi to your dog? No. No. No, I shouldn't? No. <laughs> Definitely not. Really? No, I mean, no, really. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, no. Not, I'm not kidding at all. Okay. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wanted to be, I wanted to make sure you, you, did, you believe me. <laughs> uh, yeah, he, he, uh, he's a this good guy puppy. was third, right? No, no runners, big runners. What? Is that a runner? No. Okay. You filming now? Yes. Okay, it's Dan Barger. He's from San Jose, California. And you're here helping him out? Yes, I'm just crewing. Now let's see, what was his time last year? Last year's time was 17.04, I believe. And he was the front runner last year? Yes. And he's back again this year, he's improving his times. Then. Much better, much better this time. How, uh, we're at mile 56.7? Yes. And um, this is Edinburgh Gap. Uh, he was running 40 minutes ahead of his time at the last uh, stop. Roughly. Yeah. Veach 2, is that what it was? Uh, last stop was 4 point second loop. He was running uh, close to 40 minutes ahead of schedule. Good. He's doing really well this year. If he can keep it up. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been crewing with him? Do you it's the first time I've ever crewed for him. He's just a friend, and I was in the area, and I said, okay. Heard you needed a crew, so here I am. Oh, that's neat. Do you run your stuff? There they are. <laughs> okay, <laughs> and this is his stuff here. He drinks Gatorade, Dr. Pepper, and apricot nectar. Right. And he just pours Dr. Pepper into his little bottle In for him. In his bottle. That's it. Amazing. Yes, he's pretty amazing. That is amazing. Does he lose a lot of weight? No. I think uh, he stays pretty much within his weight. That's incredible. So he doesn't take that protein jelly or any of that other uh, stuff. I think he, he may suck a goo down once in a while, but not that I'm privy to secret concoction of his, like peanut butter or something. <laughs> okay, so we're all waiting for the front runner who will be coming from there.
How are you feeling? Well, sounds pretty good. He looks like he could sign that application for next year's run. Nobody's done it three times now. She said no. How <laughs> about some bananas or sandwiches, peanut butter and jelly, uh, pretzels, salt, aspirin, Vaseline, pool of paper, any kind of supplies you might need. Yeah, I'm Wynn Waldron. Um, I, uh, I'm daughter of Pet Bots and been working the race um, off and on for the past 20 years. <laughs> and how does this race seem to be going? Oh, this is so far so smooth. We had one aid station um, back in the woods that um, we've, we missed, uh, we don't have a crew for. But the runners, it's a cool day, so I don't think it's going to bother them too much. And uh, everything's going good. Good day. The runner's time's been pretty good too because of the weather. Or? Yeah, um, it's cool, but the humidity's still up a little bit, so everybody's kind of watching themselves. Um, but you know, you never know. This is about the half mile point. Here's kind of where the race starts here at Edinburgh. Oh, there's a few Yep. <laughs> 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 Hi there. Hi. Could I ask you how, how long um, you all have been involved in, in helping out with the race and, and what you've done to support the, uh, you know, just your, what you've done to help okay, out and sure. how long? And, yeah. And well, the, uh, the Forest Service has been working with uh, Old Dominion, uh, 100 mile run since it started here in the, in the valley, which I think it's been about 20 years. And uh, we issue a, a special use permit. Uh, we've worked with a group. They've worked with us. We've uh, we've laid out trails. They've built trails. They do a lot of maintenance, and it's just been a really wonderful working relationship with the uh, you know with the with the volunteers. And it's been a it's been good. It's good for everybody. So it's been a benefit to the public as well as uh, as the as the runners. So we've uh, we've enjoyed it. Oh, you're Don Sawyer. Yeah, that's me. Are you, um, how long have you been with the Forest Service? No, I've, been, I've been with the Forest Service 42 years. And I've been here on this district for 21. Didn't he? No, this is the only, this, actually this is his first year. His oh. first year he's running. And uh, so far so good. He's doing very well. His time is turning up really good. So we're pulling for him. 
Thank you. All right. You've got a stuff laid out here. Yep. Is it okay if I take a picture oh, of a special you. array of things? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Is that a baked potato? Got a baked potato, glasses, extra shoes, got some uh, sandwiches under the shirt to keep the bugs off of them. And uh, got his hat and his gloves just in case he needs them. Thanks. What right is here. your name? Samar. Samar? Mm -hmm. And you're here, have you been, are you always his uh, backup crew? Yeah, we usually uh, run together uh, during marathons and uh, 50 milers, so uh, this is the first 100 mile and I give him all the support he can get. Mm. Thanks. Are you from Woodbridge too? Yes. Well, not where I'm walking, come on. Oh, how's it going? Okay. Still young in the day. Ain't hit half yet. Go left. Has Mike been through yet? No. But do you want to make any comments? <laughs> How's the race seem to be going this year? They have they have mosquitoes to get like small dogs. Oh, it's cool. That's a good thing. Well, that might be an exaggeration. Uh, for the runners, anyway. It's not, not raining. Like, if they yeah. cooperate, they might. Yeah, some years, so I guess that's right. <laughs> Well, it's a good run day for them. Oh, small season. Do you run too? Yeah, I finished this race in '92. You did? No. Oh. I've, I've been coming up here since 1983. They're crewing and running one or the other. <laughs> Who are you here with? This is my first time. <laughs> it's exciting, isn't it? Can I ask you how it's going? It, it is uh, going better than expected, I promise you. It's been a most wonderful run up to this point. The race is just now beginning. Though. Thank you. <laughs> what is your name? David King. David and King from Fleetwood, North Carolina. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Good what luck. is your name? I'm Sandy Flynn. Okay, Sandy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. That's she here in Washington? Or Portland? Portland. going to be special here. Whoa. It's still going to be 15, 20 minutes probably. You need to be reweighed.
Yeah, that's what he told me. He drank a roll on rock, a seven-ounce roll on rock. I drank that. I drank the Wonky Bell. And Schaefer. And it's six ninety nine. Hurry, girl. But not all at one time. Oh, that's good. Yeah. 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 Well, but for the runners, this is like the best. Run up! Yeah. 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 Hey! Oh, there he is. Right. Wait, Bebo. Oh, that's going, Mike. Woohoo! That's better than that, Tommy. Uh, probably had worse, too. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> well, I got some really good. Well, you just get uh, relatively lean meat. Exercising is there. Uh, no, How are you doing? Uh, How are you doing? Concentration. <laughs> Going out here, sharp left. Okay. Appreciate it very much. Nice, good. 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 So I care for it. I'm having so much fun, I can just die. <laughs> we may. Yep. <laughs> well, it's jerky. Thank you. That's, that's the way, that's the way you should move back. How are you doing? I'm sorry? How far? <laughs> having fun? Yeah. About three? Yep. Yeah. Good. I was afraid you wouldn't have fun yesterday. I've done, done my friend Nelson here is going out to watch that. Four timer here, Nelson. Just right. Right. You'll love it. That's what I hear. That's what I hear. She said, I'm like brother. She said, 21. She said, two. I've done it five times. Give us feet, huh? 98. 98. Go get him. 98. Looking strong. He's bored. Uh huh. Lost a little about six miles in the race by the halfway point. I had a stress fracture and whatnot. I got hypothermia. I never wanted to quit and race a bad in my life. I was hurt. The only thing that kept me from quitting is I told everybody I was going to do it. I knew I'd never hear the end of it. I bailed out. Look for you later on in the race. <laughs> I don't believe this at King Jordan. How many people were? Yeah, it didn't stop this oh, yeah.
But I've, I've done this, I've, I've done part of this thing, it's... Well, I did it backwards, I did it from the, from the gravel road on the other side, back to Elizabeth Furnace, looking for like a oh. five mile stretch at four o'clock in the morning. Well, and the guy was back in the hotel, right? No, he was here. What? Up to the top of the mountain, the trail splits, and he knew his pit crew was going to be here, so he came down here. Oh. I'm just here waiting, huh? Yeah. Now, do they have trail sweeps on this one, or are they just keeping? Um, we've got. We don't track. actually um, sweep it, but we've got a guy in the back that's um, closing out each station. Says yeah. these are the last people, yeah. and then if we have to, we'll somebody will we'll go back through the trail. So I've got some cross country runners coming here that oh, if they yeah. need to they they'll go back to the next Pace them in. Yeah. That's always a big yeah. The thing about this one is this is where the uh the aid runners are from yeah. Elizabeth Furnace oh, to here. True, the huh? assistant runners. Click your your map. There you go. Oh. What you doing? Well, have a good day and evening. I guess you'll be here till what? Six tomorrow morning? About that. Yeah. You expect him to go? At six over, so about half. So, oh no, no, it's about 40. Uh, six to six to six. To six to <laughs> Put it right here. Yeah, uh, before you get the next one, you may hit dark though. Well, I'll be on the road now. So who are you pitting for? But then you got to go back up a little bit. Oh, what? <laughs> no. You should, you should have a snow. Because you, you won't get through in the day. Hey, if you buy. I interviewed them. <laughs> Don't even aim that. <laughs> See, I make funny faces. You're going to edit Aiming that out. At the <laughs> yep, I will edit that out. Good. <laughs> this is last year's injury. <laughs> he was in second place? No, he place. was in second place. Coming out four to seven. I was seven, seven, seven. He was doing. He was doing really well. The last four miles. My next dog is no work over here. Good down in DC. I'm going to Let's go. Come back. 
I left it open. I said before. Look at I left two pounds from good. Okay, happy? Good. Of course I'm happy. The question is, are you happy? No. Well, I'm happy. But How are you feeling? 25, 30 miles. Nah, no, I don't deal. I understand. No complaints. We all got to do what we got to do. How's everything going for you? Okay, so far, thanks. Is, so, is anybody helping you? No. You I'm beyond help. Y'all help me, I still. Do you have a thing here? A uh, drop bag? No. Okay. Do you want, you want some stuff? Or? Yeah, what? If you have no, but if you have ice, you have ice. Do me a favor. Just pack this thing with as much ice as you can fit in, and then top it off with water. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's that? I love on this number. Seventy-six. Seventy-six. Matt. Can you make the interview about the interview? Has your mom been in Korea? Uh-huh. Has your mom been in Korea? That's all you can do. What are you going to do there, bud? Come on, Joe, we need you on our team. How are you doing? Got a fanny pack of chocolate. Chris, to be expected. King Jordan coming. Okay. And Dave Summit. Yeah, flashlights are out. Runners yeah. coming in. Two more. <laughs> King Jordan. Elizabeth. How's the race going for you? Good. So, of course, for about 10 minutes back there. Ah! 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, you eat and drink? yeah, I'm drinking and eating. It's oh, a yeah. long trail. He's been giving back into the okay. Oh, I believe. But, yeah. How much is he? He's uh, 165. Same. I'll only be merry once this thing's over. Yeah, you had your flashlight ready and everything. Ready to sing your butt over the dark. <laughs> Yeah, the second guy is. Okay, the other two. Yeah, the second guy is. He begged for two. No, it's not. I didn't think so. It's not. Nope. Well, he always thinks it's the The first one I've seen was a toothbrush. <laughs> Do we have to weigh in? Oh, you can. <laughs> we get a waiver, huh? Yeah. Any idea where the rest of the lights are? The only reason I help is to help Oh, that ought to get us there. Yeah. Because he's soaking wet and he doesn't have any other pants. Because he loves his mom. But oh well, I told him that. Gotta wait five seconds. Um, I don't know if you volunteered before or have you participated in the race? I, I used to do this years ago when they did it alongside the horses, and now they have two separate races, and a friend of mine runs this run, so she asked us to help, so I thought, why not? I enjoy the people, and and I like helping. <laughs> Kind of closer to you. Is this the first time you've uh, volunteered? This is the first time for this run, yeah. And I do it usually with the horses. Oh, and what are you doing um, at this station? To at this station, we're, we're putting out the food for the runners or anybody that needs something hot or something cold. Uh, they give us bags the night before with their clothes and stuff that they want to change clothes. And then I also serve as a timer. I time them in when they come in. I write down what time they get here. Okay? 
How does the race seem to be going this year? Very well. The weather's cool, and, and I think there's going to be a record times this year. Uh, the Seconds. 16 hours, 48 minutes, and 17 seconds. Oh, my chair feels Do you mind if I <laughs> ask you <Sure>. anything? <laughs> I don't know if I'll be able to answer it, but I'll try. Any comments that you'd like to make? I'm glad I'm done. <laughs> How was the course? How was this year's race? Um, it was, I don't know, it was good, it was great. It was the uh, same as last year, only it seemed like the spot from uh, uh, Elizabeth Furnace at 75 to Veach West at 86. I think Mike Robertson went and kicked a bunch of extra rocks in the middle of the trail because there seemed to be a lot more rocks than there was last year. And I'm glad to be done before dark. Oh boy. What does it feel like to run a hundred miles? How do you train? 
Um, run about I run about five days a week, and uh, anywhere from uh, 10 or 12 miles to 35 miles. Maybe once or twice a week, I'll run a long run between 25 and 35, and then occasionally uh, use a race, a 50-mile run, to uh, <clears throat> for training for it. But I don't just run uh, training runs that are 50 miles. Nothing longer than like 35 or so. So I don't know. I know you've been running for 18 years since you were 15. Yep. Um, that's true. Lots of runs. How did you get into racing? Um, I started running uh, track and cross country in high school when I was 15 and did my first ultra when I was uh, 15, a 31 mile run and did a 50 when I was 17. The trail runs and longer events seemed to be better for me. And uh, then I did my first 100 when I was 18. So I've done a few of them. <laughs> Actually, I think um, this was 186 or something like that. I don't know. I'd have to count them up. You've run 186 ultras. Ultras. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> and you've come from San Jose, California. Yeah. 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 Has, had, was, a, had a good time last year. And, Wanted to come back. Congratulations. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Yeah, I'm sorry. That's okay. Mm -hmm. That's okay. I'm Chuck Jackson. I talked to you on the phone. Oh, thanks, Chuck. How you doing? Not sad. I saw you. At I might love to have that in just two, <laughs> two seconds. Yeah. I can feel it coming. I right. saw you at Water Street this morning. I oh. Work, I worked eight stations. And oh, I saw you, you did. at Water Street and I saw you at. Uh, um, uh, Christmas Hollow when you came through the eight miles. <coughs> oh, yeah. Nobody showed up with the peach, peach orchard. Huh. Um, <laughs> a lot of the guys coming through the peach orchard today, or coming from peach orchard. Where's coming, the peach orchard? Peach orchard is <laughs> about 37 miles, maybe. Oh, okay. I think that's what it is. After orchard. four points? It's, yeah, after four points, number one, before you come to Christmas Hollow. Gotcha. Um, and uh, for some reason or other, nobody showed up to do that aid station. Uh -huh. A lot of the guys were saying they hit the wall at the, coming through the, through the, what was it called, Duncan's, Duncan's Duncan Hollow? Duncan Hollow, yeah. They, they hit the wall. They said that was the wall. Uh -huh. Was it the wall for you? No, I had my best run in between uh, 32 and 47. I was... Uh, really really pleased just because um, everything was just clicking really well and last year I ran that segment in uh, I don't know I'd have to look at the look at the splits but I think it was two hours and two hours and 30 minutes or 40 minutes and this year it was like 211 or 2:15 or something like that. I was I looking, great, I was looking at there. your time, and you were running between a nine and a ten at that point, between nine ten minutes. That's a rocky mile. section. That is one heck of a rock. I went back. Rocky and I went back about two miles, waiting for the last guy to come through. Uh -huh. And, and that's uh, the that's not really rocky there. No, it, no. It's it's a trail there. Yeah. But at um, about about another. Uh, no, I didn't. How do you spell it? No, Could you tell me his name again and how you spell it? <laughs> it's Dan Barger, B A R G E R. Dan Barger, B A R G E R, from San Jose, and he's 33 and he's been running for 18 years. That's it. Okay. That would be him. All right. Doctor, <laughs> <laughs>